Hello everyone, today we're going to be watching Rocky 5. If you guys missed my reactions to the first four Rocky movies, please do go check them out. I understand that this isn't a lot of people's favorite Rocky movie. I haven't really heard that great things about it, but I am holding my judgment until I see it for myself, of course. I'm still excited. I'm sure there is going to be some value to glean from this and yeah. Thank you guys so much for being here. I appreciate you. I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys in the comments as well. All right, let's do it. Rocky 5. Rocky. 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 It's been a one-sided fight so far. Uh, we might get some flashbacks or something with um, Mickey. I saw Burgess Meredith. I don't know how to say his first name. Saw him on here. Unless they're just using old footage of our favorite Mickey. Punch amazing power. Jeez. They're just showing the parts where Rocky gets hit. That's not how the match went. Rocky was hitting him too. All right, what's happening out there? I see three of them out there. Hit the one in the middle. The one in the middle. Oof. Where is our... Whoa! Okay, I'm gonna say, where are we going this time? That's where we're going. Straight to Porn Town. Jeez, that body. And everybody proud, especially Apollo. Apollo. <sighs> so this is right after the Drago fight, or? I can't stop my hands from shaking. Gotta get a doctor. Oh, no. I'm just tired. You can't just go just to her and say, yeah. whoa, whoa. She, he called, okay. He called her Mick. Okay. Oh, and home is far away because they're in Russia. You can't just go up to her and be like, I feel like I'm gonna die. Then refuse to go to a doctor. I don't see the kid. Where's the kid? Okay, well, his hand stopped shaking. Hi, I'm Sheila Downs, airport security. Welcome home. She recommended that boxing be banned. Do you agree with the doctors? Yeah, I think the doctor should never fight, no. That was a beautiful answer, champ. That's right. The doctor should stay out of the room. Who's this guy? America's own Rocky Balboa. How are you? How are you? George Washington. We were in the middle of something here, sir. Oh, the Russians. Now, I would, uh, I'd like to digress from the questions a bit. Security knows my reputation for promoting some of the finest extravagant he's a promoter to be held in japan called letting it go in tokyo we gotta go to japan let's go to the people i mean isn't this a question of professionalism to talk about it now not what the hell no 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 that isn't enough we gotta hear about this now you gotta think about that they just want they just want views for their news program thank what do you, you very say? much i appreciate it no Nice try, buddy. Don't worry. You'll get him. You'll get him. That guy was trying to catch him to where a place where it would be hard for him to say no in front of all those cameras and everything. I swear I ain't never leaving this place again. You know that? I swear. You Got a little homesick, I guess. No. I'm tired. Come on. Oh, yeah? Well, maybe I'll take you upstairs and violate you like a parking What? Meter. Don't say that in front of the kid. Uncle Paul. You know there's something strange Yeah. About that. He just took a, a few hard shots. I think you tell better jokes. He's like Rocky times three. <laughs> like, mm. Dad, did yeah. you know that your bones grow three times as fast during the night? Is that me? Oh, yeah, that's you. Excellent. The fish was a lot bigger, if I recall. Actually, right? that was a lot smaller. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure it was bigger. It's time for you to get healthy and everything. This yeah, grow those bones. Oh, my God. Ooh. My French teacher. Really? Damn! Um, yeah, she was French. Too. <gasps> I wouldn't show this to your mother because she, she, she don't understand French too good. <laughs> Kids got talent. That was pretty good. When you said having me was like being born again. When I see you having all these things, I like uh, dip through your eyes. I enjoy it a little bit. It's like uh, I have it all over again. That's nice. That's sweet. Hey, look at my face. Do I look like a raccoon? Yeah. 
A little bit. Yeah, like Rocky Raccoon. Yeah, a little bit. Nah. Like Rocky and Bullwinkle? Is it Rocky a raccoon? Moose and squirrel. Oh no, squirrel. <laughs> okay. Maybe you can show me your English teacher. She's pretty hot too. <gasps> no. <laughs> uh. Was it your money? It was Rocky's money. You want to be you what? Oh, come on, what'd you do, boy? He gave power, power of attorney to our accountant. Boy. What's going on? The money, the money. Wait, how is that? His deals fell through because the market dried up. And you lost millions. Oh, wait. Isn't power of attorney like when someone dies? I'm not taking a heat for all this. I, I thought I was doing smart business. How is, okay. I just don't understand how this is like all possible. I don't understand the legality of all this. Oh, Paul, you're like a no. season that don't change. Hey, you don't talk to like, her like this. I'm not how can Polly sign something for Rocky? Best fight of my life. I just did that, you know, and, and all I need is a couple more. No. Rocky, I don't care about the money. It's you. Mm hmm. That's all that matters. Yes. Please. Money be damned. Be okay. Exactly. But in his eye, in his mind the way he supports her and loves her is to provide for her balboa estate auction wow bike's been stolen hey bike's been stolen get off and none of this money is going to them right it's going to like the banks or whoever i'm assuming It's the hat he was wearing when he, they first started buying all this stuff, huh? I, I thought I'd go to Andy's. So is he acting weird because of the brain damage? I thought maybe it was because he... I don't know how to describe it. Like just his attitude, the emotions he was feeling and in, in introspection and stuff. Making him like thinking about how much he enjoys life and, and what he has and being back home and being happy to be alive that he was just kind of like on some kind of like high or like trying to show everybody that everything's okay even though he wasn't feeling like it wasn't but is it because because they said he has brain damage but like what exactly got damaged like what what is that going to manifest as wow this place is long abandoned he he he's walks like he's drunk. All right, good price. Slip the Mickey. Mickey's my favorite. You see yourself doing right, and he's my favorite. You know what the hell am I living around here for? I got no reason to go mm -hmm. on. It's true. What with you, kid? Boy, I got a reason to go. Oh. And Rocky Marciano, give me that. It's his cufflink. Now I'm giving it to you. He's gonna say, Get up, you son of a bitch! Because Mickey loves you. <laughs> oh. All right. I love you too. Go after. I have heard that if, like, if you have friends, like people close to you, people that you care about who care about you. You was each. Oh. He was. He still is. He still is your angel. If you don't have, like, people, then you don't live as long. It's just a fact. You have to have connections. It's just as important as, like, eating right and exercising. Like, it's just as important. You guys, believe me. Mickey, his angel. But what is my, the Lord is my witness. Many believe. <laughs> the music is so 90s now. <laughs> I mean, I know we're like 1990, barely in the 90s, but. Welcome back, Rocky. We missed you. So back to Polly's house. Well, Polly and Adrian's old house. Better, better than being at <laughs> Rocky's old apartment. Listen, Mr. Duke, we're living like human beings. You ought to try it sometime. Yes, you tell him. Well, we all know that Rocky's gonna end up fighting, but I wish it wasn't the case. Oh yeah! You used to use his head for a punches bag! Yeah, he had a nice head! He had a nice head. <laughs> his sense of humor is still here. 
You're saying be aware of deceptions. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, absolutely. You're very smart. Oh, he is very smart. <laughs> that's a big word for a little kid. Hey, we're gonna be late for school. Come on. Hey, Polly. I want to talk to the kid private. Does he have to go to a new school? These kids ain't like, listen to me, they ain't like no personalities that you grew up with. Oh. Uh. Every day you learn something new, and every day I forget something new. But... He's got book smarts. I'll see you later. Okay, kid. Here's the front door. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know if he's going to survive. Remember, Daddy loves you. You're number one. Home team. Please don't, don't bully him. Oh, I hope they don't bully him. He's out of his element. I know exactly what's gonna happen. Some wise guy's gonna come up to him because yeah, he's just gonna come out and try to bang him out, give him a cheap shot, you know? Yeah. How you doing? My name's Tommy Gunn. Yeah. How you doing? Oh, with a name like that, you better be <laughs> Tommy Gunn. Yeah. Well, I mean, I've saved up about four hundred bucks. Mr. Robert paid for Belmont. Oh God. Not like your Mark Twain once said. Who's Twain? He was a painter. Look. Well, now, please. this is your medical report. It's not so good, but we can work around it. How did they get that? You agree to fight Kane and Georgia and guarantee you get licensed in any country around the world. Guarantee. If they see his medical record and his brain scan, this is predatory. Yeah, get in there. Kick those guys' asses. This woman is magic. Look, I don't think you're very funny. <laughs> Adrian, you tell him. Balboa to fight Kane, huh? Looks like she's the one with the cojones in the face. Oh, fuck. I'm really sorry. I, I didn't want to. Oh, you guys want privacy now? <sighs> That's very. What's the word? Emasculating? Hey, mind if I talk to you now? My head's a little busy right now. Come on, guy. Read the room. Call me gun. <sighs> he feels like he can't take care of his family. He can't even speak for himself or make decisions for himself. And that's not going to sit well with him. Did you survive? Did he survive? Is school over? Picture in the paper. <laughs> and you know what? Your old man's a punk. Uh, what? Oh, man. Yeah, I knew this was going to happen. I'm not kidding around anymore. No way. Go. Go. Uh... That don't interest you. This cup rocking drinks as a They fixed up the, the gym? Oh, yeah. yeah. He says he wants to fight. I tell him to get married. <laughs> What's the cajonies? Oh, he didn't even know what he said. Okay, ready, guy. Benson, go easy. You're right. I bet Tommy Gunn's real good. Hey, man. Hey, come on, you guys, lighten up. It's called sparring now. Go on easy. Jesus. He's not listening. He says, I'm here to prove myself. Hey, hey, that's it. Hey, Chill out, go to go to Jesus. Get him out of here. Boxes ain't no mugging, you know. I'm sorry, but I know I can do it all. Yeah. Can you listen? Manage. Yeah. Unless you think I ain't got nothing going. Oh, Rocky could be the manager. Come on, move around. Okay. Well, maybe Rocky doesn't have to fight again. Tommy Gunn can fight the other dude. George Washington's guy. <laughs> George Washington Duke's guy. No cheap shots. Move it around. Oh no. This girl likes him, I think. How you doing? Horrible. You know, for an Italian kid, you ain't got a bad butt. Mm. What? <laughs> what? How old are they? <laughs> I wasn't looking at boys' butts when I was that age. Jeez. Well, I don't think it'd be so bad if I taught him how to throw a few deadly punches. Just, you know? just a few deadly punches. I mean murder it's okay no it's okay see my old man he used to drink a lot seriously oh i'm sorry his friends and tie one on then he'd come home and look to punch on me oh he'd punch on my mother oh at least you had an old man to knock out you know this is a very awkward dinner <laughs> just hey, he's the fittest of the survival hey tom did he say fittest of the survival <laughs> Nice. Hey, I, I don't want to cause any problems. I mean, I can find some place to stay. No, I... Wait, so he literally just came here to see Rocky and he hasn't even found a place, place to stay yet? No problem at all. You know, it'll be all right. Hey, kid, appreciate it. It's all right. It's cool. He... Hey, I'm not changing no shit. Hey, since when have you ever? <laughs> hey, Tommy, why don't you come on down? Well, I should... did, he, did he just say Polly doesn't have any maidens? If you know what I mean? Unfortunately for you, you are maidenless. Your plumbing don't leak, do it? Wet dreams. Oh my goodness. So, 
I'm gonna get it together in a little while, man. Oh. This kid got beat up on his first day of school, and now he got kicked out of his room. She's you know, a lot better wait, than Sarah. Get, get, don't, wait. don't, hey, don't change the station. I'll be right, right back. Oh. He's a fighter's best friend. You know, it ain't nothing to be ashamed of. He's really getting excited about this managing thing. But the thing is, you got to learn how to control it, all right? Oh, he can connect with Tommy with the thing that's most important to him. And his son can't connect him with that. Rock. As long as we're down here, do you mind showing me a few things? Sure, Tommy. I'm gonna show you. Uh... Gotta eat. He's hungry. He's gotta eat. We'll eat this. Uh... Father Carmine. Yo. Father. Father Carmine. You know, maybe it's not home. No, priest is always home. Uh... Hey, this guy. <laughs> if you could throw us down a couple blessings, you know, like one that I don't mess up being a manager. <laughs> this is cute. <laughs> Hey, hey, thanks, Father. I really appreciate this. <laughs> that's that's really cute. <laughs> hey, don't hurt having an angel in your corner, you know. Come on. I really love the just the focus on the characters, their interactions, and their relationships in this, their personality. I liked Rocky IV, but I felt like there there wasn't a lot enough of like this down to earth, just people raw people i mean it, it was just different i mean it had a lot of raw stuff you know but it was just i don't know so, so far i like this a lot heart heart and fire heart and fire okay now you do it he's becoming mickey <laughs> Go, God. he says he thought he couldn't manage but and he didn't know anything about managing but I mean, Mickey taught him how to do it. Oh, but this kid. This is great, but oh, this poor kid. He wants to have that connection with his dad too. He asked his father to, he asked Rocky to help him like learn how to defend himself, how to fight a little bit. And he said, no, he didn't say yes. It's time for the rhyme of the bold and the gifted. Listen closely. He's he's training this guy. Now this guy is taking the place of his son. Yeah, come on, you can do it. One handed push ups? Go, kid! I can't even do a one push up normally. <laughs> he's getting fights. Don't forget your real kid, though. <laughs> the stairs. Hey, Scott, what, what you not hey, talking to me? Gonna... Oh, he's gonna punch him. What'd you say? Go for it. Go it. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. I don't condone <laughs> his voice squeaked <laughs> i don't condone violence but that felt good and he got his coat back yeah i got no problems with that see you later yeah <laughs> well, is he gonna tell your dad yeah yeah oh but is he gonna care is he even gonna listen that's beautiful you know Okay, let's go, Tommy. Oh. Oh, look at Tommy, go! Look at Tommy, go! He thought that would be the thing that would, like, work. Damn, right? So, when he says he wants to... He thinks he's got a shot now at Balboa. Does he mean Balboa's kid, Tommy? So Rocky's got to get some money from these fights, right? He gets a cut. These are probably not super high profile fights yet, but I mean, he's, they're increasingly getting more high profile, right? Damn. I don't. Wow. Put it down for the birds to shit on. So his focus is all on Tommy and and this management thing and not on his family. 
I think that this is a good thing for Rocky, but I think maybe he he needs to like step back and like find that balance. You can get the kind of payday fights Balboa could only dream about. <gasps> oh, he's trying to take his to fighter. Goes to spoil. Keep it up. Keep it up. He's trying to buy Tommy Gun. Oh no. Your ship is sunk, Rocco. It's sunk. Uh. What? Your ship is sunk? Polly, what do you mean? The hell is this? Lampoon? Hey, come on, Adrian. He's given us some things too, you know. He's That's not the thing that Mick gave him, is it? Better not be. The cuff? Hey, you know, he just landed there and crashed and what, what do you think it is? Those kids are his friends now? The bullies? It's an unbelievable! Nice sweater. They put it together for Santa! Hey! Merry Christmas, yo, yo! <laughs> Talking with you here, you know, see, it's very important that you spend time with oh. the family, you know. He doesn't want to. Hey, Adrian, I, I know what he wants. No, you don't. Look, I ain't celebrating nothing, okay? Hey, wait a minute, hey, yo, come here. Oh. His speech has changed too. It ain't last year and you ain't the same either. He said it's important to spend time with family and Rocky's been doing the complete opposite of that. You're the one that should have watched out. <sighs> Poor Rocky. He... <sighs> he didn't do it on purpose. You take care of these people. <laughs> Polly, I'm, I'm gonna take care of these people. Tommy Gunn's got well, now he's going to lose his Tommy and his son. Nice sleep. Shit. We have to be there by 10. Rocky. No, it's okay. <sighs> I feel for Adrian. The guy was just talking about getting a shot. Like, like, but we don't need him, you know what I mean? What did he want to talk to him about? Just show him the car? Now he's leaving? If you don't, don't. But it's my way, it's the highway. <laughs> What's happening here? That's what Mickey knew. That's why you and Mickey were special. No. If there's something you want to pass on, pass it on to your yes. son. Yes. Rocky, you're losing your family. Oh. <sighs> but I gotta get out of here. He's smoking. What do you say we're going to shore, huh? Yeah, yeah let's go. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, great. How oh gosh. It's just gonna be you and me this time. Home team. Home team. You can tune a piano, but you cannot tune a fish. <laughs> <laughs> Where is this gonna go? Why are they booing him? It's like the fans are unhappy with Tommy Gunn for leaving Rocky Balboa. Oh. Help the ropes. Are you blind? Ah. That's it! Well, he's doing all right. Is Tommy gonna win? Ooh! I thought he was gonna get humiliated. getting booed though Mr. George what's the duke yeah! <sighs> he left you behind champion thank duke of the guy that got him yeah. wow you're the real champ around here i made this for you oh yeah ah uh. go watch tv okay but don't just steal too late you got to get them bones going all right yeah grow them bones i got to go grow some bones too pretty soon here do you think the fight was too easy? Hey, give me a few good shots, but I was never hurt. I mean, I'm just glad. Oh, like, was it? Yeah, 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 I'm very observant. Union Kane wasn't feeling that good, but. Oh, was it a setup? Was it, uh, rigged? You've got to fight some real opponents, right? And I'm the best fight. tonight. I... Oh. Why don't you fight the redhead in the front row? I hear she comes real cheap. Uh, what about. What? Man, why didn't you take that from me in there? Oh, listen to me. When the press is right, they're right. Right, man. Whoa. There's a way for you to get the respect you deserve, but what you got to do is challenge Balboa to fight him. Oh, man. Rocky's gonna fight after all. 
or you're gonna be getting questioned like you heard tonight for the rest of your life. Then you're gonna start to ask your He's retired. You gotta do whatever you got to do to get him into that ring, but that's what you got to do. This was all part of his plan, wasn't it? Well, Rocky, you need some help? No, guys, ain't no pie and kind. <laughs> you wanna shoot some eight ball or something? Hey! Man, I ain't do talk. Oh gosh, get out of here. Oh god. If you just a goddamn joke. Oh, just get out of here. Break Tommy, the Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. No! Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. You should have left them on the street where you found them. Get on me, man. Right here, right here, huh? Oh man. My ring's outside. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> Don't mess with with his Polly. Polly may be a a Polly, but but Polly's been there for Rocky this whole time. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh god! Oh shit! Oh! Fight! Come on, let's get out of here! Come on! Come on! You're always a champ, Rocky. Great. Oh no! You no! Don't hit a man from his back! Whoa! Oh god! Oh, cheap shot. No, no, stop. Stop. His head. Ah. Uh. It's dead. He's on television. He's fighting. What? Yeah. What is right? Come on. Oh. Cool, Who's your now, huh? Man. Sylvester Stallone knows how to how to write drama. Jeez. Oh no, his head. <laughs> one more round. Come on, Rocky. Rocky, come on. Well, if we're doing this, you better do it right, Rocky. Get him. Show him what it's like to fight your way to claw your way up tooth and nail as they say. This is a pretty rad remix or whatever this is. It's a street fight right here. Touch me and I'll sue. <laughs> Touch me and I'll sue. <laughs> keeps coming from behind that's not right well i guess it is a street fight oh no here comes rocky jr oh! <laughs> got some wrestling moves he took my room <laughs> this is crazy Oh, no, no, no. Not too many hits to the head. Oh, no. Here, here's Adrian. Jeez. This guy should not have punched Polly. Put him in the street. God damn. Old in America. That was cr that was entertaining. Wow. Y'all class the bum, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Now he's calling him a bum. <laughs> yeah. oh, come on, don't. This guy is. Oh. Come on, pug. Touch me, I'll sue. <laughs> don't do it. He's not worth it. Here too, Father Carmine. <laughs> okay. Oh, I don't know. It's like these deaths keep growing taller. Every... <laughs> as long as this thing is here, Pigeons is always gonna have a place to and sit. And a place right? to shit. <laughs> you got something growing here. You got like, like, like a bump. A bump. <laughs> this bump.
Yes. <laughs> Aww. Thank you for being born. Aww. I will, uh, you look like the daughter that I always wanted. <laughs> well, you never too old to learn something new. Yeah. You're going to love Picasso. <laughs> and Mark Twain, <laughs> the, the painter. <laughs> Out of hands are all you own. Oh, I love I loved it. I loved it. Well, I'll be curious to hear why people don't like this one. Entertained. I had a good time. Okay, I guess it doesn't take a lot to entertain me or to please me. Um what I loved about that movie was the focus on where Rocky came from, his relationship with Mick, and everything that Mickey did for him, and everything that Mickey taught him. And I love the focus on the relationships between the characters, the being a family, or like the hardships with Rocky being unable to kind of let go of this, this fighting mentality or being in the fighting world kind of like with apollo he just couldn't get out of it it's what made him feel alive and we saw rocky just come to life when he was training tommy and even when he first started talking to tommy about it when he made that decision i loved that we got to see uh his son got to take like a, a prominent kind of role in this film as well that was really awesome to see how he looks up to his father and how he just wanted his father's attention to believe that his father loved him, cared about him. And that fight at the end, I mean, I love the boxing matches, but that street fight, that was some good stuff. Like, that got really crazy. I loved seeing uh, new scenes with Mickey. I'm really glad that they filmed those. And it just, it's just a movie that really makes you think back about everything that happened you know and when he and adrian first got together training with mickey brought them back to where he came from the same streets father carmine mickey's boxing uh studio i thought it was good i really liked it so please tell me what you guys think about this movie how do you rank the rocky movies that i've seen thus far I know we still have six to watch, but <sighs> good stuff. Good stuff. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed this movie, but if you don't, I would love to hear why. I'm sure you guys have some very good reasons and everybody's opinion is valid and everybody likes different things and no movie is perfect and we like what we like. Until next time, guys, for Rocky 6, I'll see you guys then. Thank you again and goodbye.